How's it going, you guys? New Age here with our team build for this week's showdown battles using our gym leader team. So this week we're using Chuck's team, and uh, I've given it a few test runs. This is what I normally do before I do each of the um, each of the weeks for showdown, just so I can get the hang of kind of how to use the team um, and maybe get some ahead of time changes, I guess. Um, and I've learned two things about this team. One. Uh, I can't really do anything against some certain Pokemon big time, like, I want to say grass types, I can't really do anything against, uh, and also this whole team gets kind of destroyed by, uh, Talonflame, so, wish me luck with, uh, with this week, cause it does not seem like it's gonna go well, especially after last week with the ghost team, we did pretty well with that one, so, it's gonna suck going back, going back to how it was. Um, so anyways, this is the team so far. We've got Halucha with the Lumberry, Unburden, uh, Home Claw, Stone Edge, High Jump Kick, Acrobatics, Max Speed, Max Attack, 4 in HP with the Adam and Nature. Um, pretty much the usual, I could switch this out to a status condition, um, get the Unburden off, cure it with the Lumberry, and then Home Claw's boost so I don't miss High Jump Kick or Stone Edge, and it hits uh, nice and hard. So, uh, Halucha will probably be the one to save me most of the time, if I can manage to get it going. Another thing I also realized is this team is pretty weak to uh, entry hazards and stuff, but there's nothing I could really do about that. Um, you'll see I have something to try, but there's no rapid spinners or uh, defoggers from what I can tell uh, what, I, what I was able to make with this team, so that kind of throws things off quite a bit. Uh, so next we got the Pangora with the Assault Vest and Mold Breaker, Earthquake Crunch, Poison Jab, Stone Edge. Uh, I gave it max investment in HP and defense, uh, and then made it adamant with the special defense. Just because, like I said, Talonflame was a thing, so I'm hoping I can potentially take a hit from Talonflame and then get a Stone Edge off, call it a day. But I need a safe switch in, and I wouldn't have uh, be able to take any entry hazard damage, so... Like I said, a lot of a lot of ifs, a lot of ifs going on. Uh, so next we got Chestnut with the Rocky Helmet, Bulletproof, uh, Spiky Shield, Leech Seed, Hammer Arm, Wood Hammer, with uh, also a defensive nature, and uh, max HP, max defense, and four in special defense. Uh, this is basically for physical attacking Pokemon that can't really get, uh, that aren't super effective to the team, basically. Chestnut can just kind of wear him down without having to worry about damage, and I can heal back and all that good stuff. So that's what Chestnut's for. Even though I've realized a lot of things are pretty effective against fighting types as of lately. Uh, so next we got Keldeo with the Choice Scarf Justified, uh, Hydro Pump Scald, Icy Wind, Focus Blast. Uh, I think I am. It was Sacred Sword to begin with, and I was like, why this doesn't make any sense. Um, but I have realized um, with some people using Chansey and Blissey, that does give me an option to hit them with, so that'll be nice. Uh, I think I'll go with that. So it's a hasty nature, max special attack, max speed, and four in attack. And uh, yeah. Next we got to rack you on with the Focus Sash. If anything, that's why I need uh, to not have to deal with entry hazards as well, because. Uh, Terrakion is really uh, a good Pokemon to uh, get Stealth Rocks off and then get some pretty good damage. I'm thinking, I don't know what to do because Stealth Rocks would really help, but there's nothing else that gets Stealth Rocks. But I would like to have room for a, uh, a physical attack, or not physical, a rock attack, but I don't see that happening. Because this would be my answer to Talonflame then if that were the case, because I could survive a hit. But then again, I'm rockin' fighting, so I'm pretty sure I could survive a hit anyways. Uh, I just wouldn't really have anything to hit back with. That's the problem. But yeah, we got Stealth Rock, Close Combat, Earthquake, Quick Attack, uh, Jolly Nature, Max Speed, Max Attack, and 4 in Special Defense. I'm gonna go ahead and put that in Defense. Just cause. And then we got Verizion. This is basically my answer to uh, Stealth Rock if I can. Uh, I figured I'd put it on Verizion because it's a Grass type, so it's also unaffected by Sleep and all that. Uh, I think I'll give it a. I want to give it a special move. Maybe like Giga Drain. Because if I do get hit by a Will O Wisp, since I'm dealing with a Pokemon that have status, 
or yeah, status moves and all that. Uh, that might be nice. Yeah, I'm gonna go with that. I'm gonna go with the Giga Drain. Uh, and then Stone Edge is if something is trying to switch into Town Flame and I can predict that. That'll be nice to hit it with Taunt, obviously, so they can't set up uh, that kind of stuff on me. Uh, I don't know what to do because I do need a Fighting type move. I think I have to get rid of Synthesis and go for Focus Blast. Um, oops. So I am gonna go ahead and do that just because uh, I need an answer to uh, Ferrothorn. Because that'll be a good opener and a Focus Blast will help me with that. And then, yeah, like I said, Grass uh, typing, which is why I did it with Viridian, so I can't be affected by Sleep Powders, Leech Seed, all that good stuff. And I gave it leftovers. And it's got a uh, max HP, max speed, and four in attack. And, uh, eh, I don't know if I'm okay with this. I mean, I guess. Hopefully the special attack is good enough. So uh, that's going to be the team. We'll see how it does. We'll see how it does. I am nervous, got to admit. But uh, if you if you got that faith in the team, go ahead, leave a like. If you want to see more and the rest of these battles throughout the week, you can subscribe to my channel, New Age Steel, where I upload multiple videos every single day. And you can also follow me on Instagram and Twitter, where I post first-hand information on when I upload videos to the channel. So until then, I'm New Age Steel. Keep on watching, and I'll see you guys next time.